Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to start highlighting some of the great cities, suburbs, and neighborhoods around Kansas City, and we're going to start with Lee Summit. So here are our top five reasons why you should move to Lee Summit. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Taylor. This is Curtis. As much as we love doing these videos for you, uh, we also love helping you with your real estate needs. I'm a broker, Curtis is a real estate agent, so if you have any real estate needs, please reach out. Be sure to also like, subscribe, and hit the bell button so that you get updates every time that we put out a new video. Let's jump to it. All right, so our first reason to move to Lee Summit is the proximity in Kansas City. We are just southeast of Kansas City, and it's pretty easy to get to anywhere. Um, it's right off the 4, 435 loop. I love that as a realtor because I can get around town very, very easily. Uh, we're about 15 minutes to downtown Kansas City, 45 minutes to the airport, and about 10 minutes to the stadium where you can go watch the Chiefs or the Royals play. So getting around and uh, through Lee Summit in Kansas City is very, very convenient. The number four on our list is the Lee Summit School District. So the Lee Summit School District has three major high schools, four middle schools or junior high schools, and a plethora of elementary schools. Now the school district has a 93% graduation rate. They rank above the state average in English, math, reading, as far as the state testing goes. And a little fun fact about Curtis and I, we are both graduates of Lee Summit West High School. Go Titans. So there's uh, Lee Summit West, Lee Summit North, and the original Lee Summit High School. The OG. All right, so coming in at number three on our list is recreation, mostly outdoor recreation. Um, anywhere you want a good work-life balance, so there's plenty to do in Lee Summit if you need to get out of the house. Uh, we've got several parks around town. Uh, one of them actually has access to the Rock Island Bike Trail or Walk Trail. Um, it's about a 13-mile trail that goes from the stadiums all the way through Lee Summit. Eventually, it's supposed to connect into Pleasant Hill and connect to the Katy Trail so you can bike or walk to your heart desires. We've got plenty of indoor recreation, you know, if you're into sports or if you've got kids that are wanting to play basketball, pickleball, things of that nature. We've got several community centers. Um, and then we also have a lot of indoor options like escape rooms. We've got Sky Zone. We've got a go-kart track coming here pretty soon. That's right, coming the summer. We're pretty excited about that. We'll do a video on that later. Coming in at number two on our list is the shopping in Lee Summit. So Lee Summit has several developments for shopping. We've got Summit Fair, Summit Woods. That's going to be more of your big box stores, your Targets, your Best Buys. And then we also have Streets of West Pryor, which is brand new. Uh, they've got franchise restaurants or more chain restaurants. They've also got brand new apartments going in there as well. Um, and then if you want more of that local feel or you want to shop local, we do have an option for that. So check out number one. All right, so coming in at number one, this is our local favorite, and that is the downtown Lee Summit area. It is a traditional square, lots of shopping. This is gonna be more of your localized shopping, your, your local independent vendors. There's several great little uh, boutiques down there. And then during the evening, it kind of turns into a nightlife hub. Um, several bars around town. You've got a speakeasy, the W. Yes. Um, our favorite, kind of the town favorite, is Third Street Social. That's definitely one you should check out. You should maybe look into reservations if it's gonna be a Friday or Saturday night. They also do a lot of uh, events downtown. Pretty much every holiday, so St. Patrick's Day, Halloween. Uh, they've got different parades downtown on Saturdays, mm -hmm. downtown days in the summer, and then Oktoberfest in the fall, which are, they close the streets down at downtown Lee Summit and uh, just have a great time. We're filming this in December right now, and downtown is just lit up. Every tree, every street corner, um, it's all decked out in holiday lights, so that's always a fun thing to see as well. Yeah, and when it starts to warm up, you know, April, May, you can even grab a beverage at your favorite watering hole downtown, uh, walk around downtown Lee Summit into the different boutiques as well. Yeah, do not miss out on the downtown Lee Summit Square if you are going to visit or move to Lee Summit. So that's gonna wrap it up for us. Uh, check out our other videos to see all the other areas in uh, Kansas City. As much as we love doing these videos for you, uh, we also love helping you with your real estate needs. I'm a broker, Curtis is a real estate agent, so if you have any real estate needs, please reach out. Be sure to also like, subscribe, and hit the bell button so that you get updates every time that we put out a new video.